Hello. Awesome. Hello everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we're playing a, a mod pack called... Well, it's not a mod pack, it's just a mod called Wyrm Roost. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that. Wyrm. Worm. Wyrm. But it is a game... Or it's not, It's a mod that adds lots of dragons. And they're very cute sometimes, and sometimes they're very scary. This is called a silver glider. What I have on my head is a silver glider, and as you can probably guess, you can glide with it. It's snowing right now, so I gotta be careful about where it land. But yes, you can glide with the silver glider. A lot of the other dragons actually, like, fly. But, uh... I haven't reached a stage yet where I have any of those dragons. That sound you just heard is from a type of water dragon that's very spook. You really don't want to mess with those. In in unless you really want to mess with those. Because <laughs> they go really fast in the water. Uh, those ones you can like ride. Alright, I'm going to do this in third person a little bit so that I can see a little bit better because the rain is very foggy. So basically, why I'm looking for a swamp is because uh, back at my base, which we can see later if our mission is successful or if it's a failure, uh, what we'll be able to see, or I'll show you my base. It's not much right now, but it's a cool place. It looks extra great with the shaders I'm using. Um, which actually don't have waving leaves, which is kind of sad. I wish that they had that. Ooh! Uh... I need ender pearls in order to put dragon- in order to, like, hold dragons. Okay. Gotta get in the water fast! Alright. Come at me, bro. Ender bro. Okay, come here. Come here. No, not you. <laughs> I'm trying to put the guy on the head so that he doesn't get in the way of anything. <laughs> this is already pure, pure chaos. There we go. Alright. Maybe I should turn on hitboxes to see if it if he drops a pearl around here. Hello? Mr. Ender Dragon? Mr. Ender Mr. Enderman? Are you there? Huh. Guess 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 we lost him. That sucks. Excuse me. Hello guy. There we go. Alright, let's continue onward. And I'm not going to be collecting any sugar cane because I already have too much of it. Just from searching. I did a lot of searching already. This stream will only be going on for like uh, an hour because I have. Ooh! I have a free period right now in school. So. I'm able to do this stream, but I won't for a while longer. So I trapped this guy in a hole, or in like a box that I made out of dirt, and then I'm just gonna spam these fish on him, and then that'll tame him. And I'm trying to build up like an army of these guys. I don't know why. <laughs> It'd probably be a lot faster to not do that. I'm also just gonna press shift every once in a while to Make sure I don't waste fish. Because if he's tamed and I shift right click him, he'll sit down. Oh, this is gonna take a second. I have found something weird. It works better while you're in a boat.
This is taking a lot. Ooh, ooh, yes, yes, I got him. All right, we got two now. And then I also have one other back at my base. I used to have two others, but then one of them died in lava. It was very sad. Ah. Oh, there's a block right there. All right. Here we go, let's try to get as far as we can on this one glide. All right, nice. So we are looking for a swamp. And I do want to stay kind of close. Do I have any eggs? Aha, I have a bunch of eggs. All right, uh, these guys are called root stalkers. Wait, where'd he go? I think they probably went, okay, this, this guy is called a root stalker. And you give him eggs. Oh, nice! Any more? I think that I saw another one. Uh, yes, here we go, here's one. Ha! Alright. I got all my guys with me, let's onward! Building up an army. I'm trying to collect every dragon. I have a lesser wyrm that I got from a desert already. Those guys are interesting. They stick their little heads above the ground. I'm also not too concerned about losing any of these guys, because they're pets, so they'll teleport to me. And I have my render distance set fairly high. Alright. Uh, swamp. Um, I guess I should just continue this way. Come here, I need a glider. Oh crap, it didn't work. I didn't glide. Uh, okay. Oh, we're, we're fine. Alright, uh... Anything good in this village? In the class? Am I in class? No? Yeah. You're supposed to be doing oh, papers. Figure. Yeah. Yeah, I'll do that. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Well, that was annoying, but uh. No, I'm just gonna keep going. I'm gonna do the wishes later. Uh, swamp. I'm just getting a bunch of this here. I could make a. Oh, shears. Is that faster? No. Hmm. So previously when I searched, I searched sort of like on the water. I was kind of just looking around, going up and down. And uh, there's, a, there's, there's an ocean that I flew over a little bit, starting sort of in the mountain range by my base. And then uh, I, just, I just stayed on that ocean for a long time, and I went around a bunch. And then I went around so much that I went full circle. Like I went all the way around the ocean and didn't end up, or I did end up back at my base, but I did not find a swamp. Which is why I must now quest inland. And I decided to stream also because I was gonna play for a little bit, and I need some more videos in my library. Library. <laughs> it's kind of weird to think of a video. Okay, so I looked at some uh, stuff, and swamps spawn mostly off of forests and plains. 
quests and plans. So we should go around this plain a bunch. I also don't remember exactly what the swamp trees look like, so that kind of sucks. I think that's a savanna. Yeah. Oh, I just found Colin! Dude! Hi! <laughs> I don't think he knows that I'm behind him! interesting. <laughs> not scripted. That's, I mean, the chances, like, we're so far, okay, we're not that far away. We're, like, only, like, a thousand blocks out. All right, let's go. Yes! That's what my stream is for. Colin might know where one is, or... He just also wants to find a swamp. So how many blocks is a kilometer? That's what I've been wondering. Because in the uh, uh, in the statistics panel, wait, where'd he go? All right, he's over there. Okay. Oh gosh, I accidentally turned on the narrator. Uh, ah, okay, there we go. I need one of you guys. There we go. Okay, that is food. So, one of the things that we found interesting about this mod, and that we don't- Wait, where'd he go? Oh, over there and we don't really understand yet is how if it's possible slash how to like transfer dragons between people since I have these guys tamed Colin can't use them but I have two gliders so it would be nice if Colin could use one of the gliders but we haven't figured out how to do that yet there is something where you can like put them into a stone like kind of like a pokeball and carry them around with you or put them in chests and stuff but we tried like giving like handing those to each other and having them bring them back into the world, but you can't do that. It doesn't let you. And there's the shaders. <laughs> oh, and uh, lighting, nice. Ooh. All right, these shaders are about to get funky. <laughs> no, no. Uh, I think they just spawn randomly. That did not work as I intended. <laughs> uh, disconnect. The chances of somebody watching this live are very small, so, uh, yeah. But if you do watch this as a playback, thank you. 
Ah, yeah, there we go. <laughs> Look at that. Look at how the light, like, goes through the, like, membrane on the wings. It's like a flat surface. Like a, there's like a plane with texture. Colin's going down there? Alright. Um, uh, hmm. Oh, it's so pretty with these shaders. Oh my god. Alright, Swamp Swamp, where do you be? Better find you soon. For no reason, necessarily. Um, is this the mountain range that's by my base? No, I don't think so. I mean, if it is, I'll have to show Colin, but... I don't think so. I don't think it is. Alright, I, I, guess, I guess we're just following Colin, because he might have some sort of method for this. I sure don't. Dude. Oh, hey. How did I end up having these in my offhand? There we go. I wish you could, uh, I need, I need a mod that, like, increases the size of people's names. Because I've just been playing a lot of Scrap Mechanic and Rocket League recently. In Scrap Mechanic, uh, there's no, like, distance in which the names disappear. Like, you can see the names of other people infinite distances apart. And then, uh, in Rocket League, the names have a color behind them, and they're really big. And they're always layered on top. Like, they, they don't get lighter when you go behind something, like they do in Minecraft. This is the second season, I guess, of this, because uh, we did we did one earlier, but uh, Nathan, who runs the server, forgot to uh, <laughs> allocate more RAM to the server, and uh, so he went to put more RAM in, and uh, to do that he ran a bat file, but the bat file was referencing the vanilla Minecraft jar rather than the modded jar, so that basically deleted all the modded items from our inventory. And it, so something interesting about the dragons is they don't, they don't like spawn des and despawn, they spawn once when the chunks are generated, and then they don't, they never those chunks will never spawn new dragons again. Instead, the dragons wander, like they move around. I don't know if they're like anchored close to their spawn area. Like I don't know how far they'll wander, but that's just how it works. I lost him. Where'd he go? Aha! I found him. There we go. Onward. Ew. No! No, 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 no! No! Ah. Bruh. Yeah. Yeah, did. All right, so let's uh continue. I have I have enough fish to tame another one when it becomes my time. Interesting. Come here. Yeah. 
Yeah, all right, you'll, you'll just follow me. Okay, there's a butterfly leviathan. That's what the that's what the guys in the ocean are called. I gotta get the. Ah! Can can I not pick him up while I'm in a boat? Come here. No. Yes, I got it. All right. Here we go. <laughs> those little those little guys will just Oh god. No, don't go that way, Colin. No. Alright, are my little guys following me? I don't know if they are, but it's okay. They they don't actually do much. They don't really have much sentimental value. They're basically just eggs. He wants berries. Okay. <laughs> Interesting. I guess while he's getting berries, I'll get some of these fish. Because even though the gliders can't go underwater, they eat fish. Like, they're tamed and healed using fish. Which makes a lot of sense, I, am I right or am I right? They're explained as kind of like cats, sort of. The silver gliders, in that they... Uh, they you tame them kind of like cats, where like they're skittish, you have to like move very slowly as to not like scare them away. All right, um, and unsit. Uh, cats can do that. Oh gosh, the server TPS. I'm just trying to eat this food. Oh! Stop moving. I need to wait for it to look away. Bruh! Alright. I don't remember how to tame these guys. Okay. Alright, swamp. Oh, we're getting out of our boats here? Alright. There's an overland guy over there. Oh. I don't know if he sees it. I should turn off my hitboxes. Hitboxes are really interesting with the shaders. Because they like subtract from it, but are also like actually not super detrimental. Okay, oh man, I gotta. I gotta make, make, make sure I'm at full health before we encounter the overland guy, which is this, this, that green guy over there. Alright, he got his berries. <laughs> Do I have any cooked meat? No, I don't. I'll have to cook some later in order to like eat. Overall Drake. Dude, why would he run so close to it? Okay, it, look, it doesn't seem like it's pursuing us. That's good. Whoa, what was that sound? I heard it. That's ah, phantom. That's what the sound is. That's that's a phantom, dude.
for a moment. Ah! Ah! Defend me, silver glider. All right, hope, hope, hopefully he'll join back soon. Yeah. Come here. Come here. There we go. All right. Oh, good. All right. Continue. We will add that's a ravine. Apparently swamps also can spawn at the bottom of ravines, but that doesn't make any sense. Oh, slimes. Like a slime chunk. I see. And by the way, if you just came here, uh, we're looking for a swamp so that we can get slime balls. And we need slime balls in order to make a leash, which you, it's kind of funny because you actually need the leash in order to tame a certain kind of dragon. It's called... I don't actually remember what it's called. But, uh, uh, we need a leash. And what we do is we take that leash and then we leash a bee. Like a bumblebee. We leash the bee and then we have to... And whoever the bee is tethered to when it finishes off the bee, it, that's, that's who tames it. So that's how you tame those dragons. And those dragons are amazing because, like, they're fast. You can, like, ride on them. Oh, yes! Yo! Yes, swamp! Swamp! We finally did it. We found the swamp. Dude. DM me the chords for safe keeping. Ah! There's a butterfly leviathan. Wouldn't it suck if we got snapped by that butterfly leviathan, like, now? Yes! Swamp achieved! Dude, okay, now we just need to find slimes. No! Alright, you're staying on my head can't have you teleporting into blocks like that other one. Alright, uh... Even though it lowers my movement speed a bit. Um... Slime. Big green bouncy boys. I think what, should, what we should do is we should cut them up into smaller pieces and then wait for them to regrow. So that we can, it's it's kind of like breeding. We can like breed slimes. Cause when they're small, they grow bigger. Oh, he just left. All right, I'm gonna do F3C. Okay, nice. Oh, there's a witch's hut! <laughs> That's pretty funny. Alright, but I don't see any slimes. So we just have to uh, wait for one to spawn. I think I'm gonna go up on that mountain and end the stream. Uh, because basically I just have to wait for a sun to spawn. And our mission, our mission has been completed. We have located the swamp. And found Colin under mysterious pretenses. I'm also very happy because the swamp is on. You know, I'm just gonna end the stream here. The swamp 